In this video, I'm going to show you how to relieve any muscle tightness coming from the SCM, so the sternocloid mastoid muscle group, the upper fiber traps that are based into the skull, and even the levator scapula, which tends to be a muscle that gets quite tight. So these muscles can get quite tight and they can often lead to contributing factors such as headaches, neck pain, neck stiffness, neck tightness. So all you need for this is a tennis ball. So simply first, to find the SCM, what we're going to do is rotate our head to the left if we're going to do the right side, and we can feel where the muscle group is, it comes all the way up to behind the ear. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna place the ball just behind the ear, apply some pressure, and then from then, you can then release the head back into a neutral position. And we can work on circular motions of massage. We can go up and down, we can go left to right. It's simply just locating where those tender spots are, which will be different for everyone. And then just working through maybe 10 to 15 seconds on an area, apply more pressure if you need to, take some off, just being, just changing up what you need to. And we go all the way down towards the attachment of this muscle, which would be onto the collarbone. So work your way through there for about a minute, do it on both sides, and that'll be the first part. Second part, we can look at to the base of the skull, so where the upper fibers of traps attach into. So we're gonna just roll down from the head into where the back of the neck is. And again, the same thing applies. We're gonna go backwards and forwards, maybe 10 to 15 seconds. We can go upwards and downwards. And we can go circular motions. So we're just going to work our way around where we feel the restrictions, apply more pressure on, and then just follow the same routine as you did before. And last but not least, we're going to focus on relieving subscapula, which tends to be a bit more around the back. And we do the same thing here. We're just going to be working ourselves a little bit lower, a little bit more tricky to work. So you just have to take some time, some patience. You could use your other hand if you need to. Just work on just releasing all the tension that might be around that's contributing to your neck and pain. So that's it. I hope you find it useful. Any questions, give me a shout.